Hey guys, it's Susururu and Marvin. And we are Say What TV. I really want to be him when I grow up. I want to be you when I grow up. Although I have to regress. <laughs> I have to regress the time to be him when I grow up, but he kind of does everything. So, Jay, wow. Well, you'll have a really, a really uh, dark tan if he, if he becomes you. I'm good with that. Look at his skin. Though. Like it's silky smooth. This is Marcus Majors, guys. Check out some of the stuff that he's done. Dream big, smash goals, be great is Marcus Major's philosophy. Is it an accident? Know your rights. A young creative entrepreneur, Marcus Majors has made a name for himself in the entertainment industry with his vast array of skills and talents. What's up folks? Welcome to the Casting Calendar. It's so to get hidden talent and sophomore exposure. I'm your host, Marcus Majors. With big dreams and even greater ambition, Majors brought his dreams to full fruition by working with some of today's hottest entertainers. Mr. Marcus Majors. Um, model, actor, yeah. TV host, dancer. Not a singer, though. Not a singer. He's not a singer. He okay. sings in the shower. Whoa, there's yeah. one thing we got on him. Right, 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 right. I ain't got it. Which one is your favorite <laughs> talent? Um, dancing. Dancing. Of course. Yeah. Yeah, right. And do you think that you use a different part of your brain for each one of those talents? Um, I would say the same. Same brain? Right? Same, same. same side of the brain? Uh, for me, it's just the confidence. Mm -hmm. Just yeah. especially for dancing, just right. taking music, sitting in it, just letting the music just take away your soul. Just like. Killing. Right, that's I ain't gotta it. worry about it. As right. dancers, the moment we start thinking, that's when you oh, start yes. throwing stuff out. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You, you miss the count. <laughs> you, can take a, you, can take a, you can take a simple step, touch, Yo, step, touch, and screw that fish, shit up you, just you, by you thinking think about it. it. And then that's the same with even you know taking pictures. And you know, I'm not worried about how my face looks. It's just like just pose just and just yeah. have fun. And same thing with acting. You know, the moment you start thinking about the monologue, it's, it's, it's over. Right. So tell me about your, your show, The Casting Couch. So The Casting Couch TV um, has been around for, it's actually going on its fourth season, and I'm the host of season four. It's Very a cool. show geared to, you know, pretty much just taking hidden talent in South Florida and exposing it, you know, from, you know, anywhere from the arts to politicians um, to, you know, entrepreneurs and, you know, activists and things like that. Yeah, season five, season five, huh? <laughs> so, I mean, we sit them down. I, I take two guests at a time each episode. It airs every Wednesday at 9 a.m. Mm -hmm. uh, and you can watch the seasons on TV, I mean, on uh, the network, which is becastingcowstv.com. Um, and every week, you know, we have an episode. And I just sit down with two guests and they just pretty much tell us about what they do and, uh, and bring that exposure to, like, to some people in South Florida who don't even know about you know, We don't know about them, you know? And that's just... The benefits, we have so much talent in South Florida so and everywhere. Talent. Like, you know, the show's not even geared to South Florida, but, you know, we're looking for different areas and spots, mm -hmm. but it's like, there's so much talent in it. And I would say out of mind, I was just telling her, you know? Mm -hmm. yeah. So we're trying to bring that light to people. Right. That's been your biggest challenge. <laughs> Shooting the show? Sure, and host, hosting the show. Hosting the show, the biggest challenge. Um, probably doing the research on the guests. Yes. Yeah. I mean, that's with any hosting you know, right. job that you get. I mean, any blogger or journalist knows, like, especially if nowadays, the old school, there wasn't internet. You didn't put that much stuff on the internet. Right, right. So now it's like digging up stuff. It's like, yeah. well, you know, this person is big in what they do, right. but ain't nothing on the internet for them. Right. So you kind of got to just go on and do your research. Right, right. How to cook into my journalist skills. You know, right, right. Do you get nervous? <laughs> 
um, like for us, we're like, oh, you know, because we do comedic skits, we do things outside of the box, so we're always like, oh, are they going to be comfortable? Right. Or like, what's their personality like? And um, I don't get nervous. Yeah. Um, I think the formality of the show when I was reading off the teleprompter and things like that, mm -hmm. you know, that was like a beginning stage of kind of like understanding how it is and just bouncing back and forth. Uh, but I'm always like comfortable. Like once I get going, mm -hmm. it's good. Yeah. Right. So like from the first episode to you know the episode that we have going next mm -hmm. week, is I'm a whole you different can see. person. You yeah. can see. Yeah. Like, right. I'm like, all right, all right we're right. here now. Welcome to the yeah. casting yeah. calendar. Right. You know, I'm your host, Marcus <laughs> May. Just like the whole just right. you know schematics of everything just changed, and that's how everything that I'm doing now. For my first casting when I joined the industry, as far as dancing, I was mm -hmm. in there like. Mm -hmm. All these dancers, all mm -hmm. these actors. Mm -hmm. Now I'm like, man, walking in like, boom. Like, I'm the shit. What's up? Bam. <laughs> Bam. <laughs> Superstar. Bam. Like, yo, I'm here. Where we, we at? Yo? And that's just how it is. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very cool. What do, you do, what do you love most about what you do? Um, for me, as far as like traveling and doing what I do as far as TV and film, I think the biggest thing that I love about it is the fact that I'm inspiring so many people through you know, my art and my craft. Uh, so many people say that, you know, through me, like f social media and Facebook and Snapchat, it's like, I live through your snaps, I live through the posts that you make. It's because some people can't fathom the idea of doing it, mm -hmm. and, uh, and some people want to do it. So with me, not only am I living out my passion, I'm inspiring so many other people to do the same thing. So how important is the role of social media in, in society today? Social media is like number one. You know, when it comes to marketing and branding, we always say, you know, word of mouth is like the biggest, you know, it's number right, one. Right. But social media is like right there now. Uh, with Instagram, Snapchat popping, DJ Khaled, and, you know, all these different social media influencers, as they like to call them. Uh, having the number of followers and having the, the engagement now on social media is, is very, very important. So you need to post like, you know, Every once a day, three times a right. day. You know, if you're if you're missing a day of posting, you're, you're, you're losing out. We know somebody you know? who actually got blocked because they yeah. post so much. <laughs> <laughs> but it's, I mean, it, but it's necessary, you know, just to have the engagement from your fans or, or, or stay relevant. Right. You know, it's, it's, it's pretty much staying relevant, yeah. you know, and then having those followers and having those likes uh, bring awareness to what you do and, and, and to others to see right. what you do as right. well. So right, it's, right, it's right. very, very important. Okay, so this brings me to where can we stock you? Your new fans and your old fans. Okay. Not talking about your old fans, like, you know, old fans. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you can find me on uh, Facebook, uh, Marcus Majors. I have a like page there. Also, you can go to my website to find everything, www.marcusmajors.com. Um, from anywhere from Snapchat to Instagram to Twitter, it's the same. M underscore Majors LF. That LF stands for Ladies Favorites. It's an old group that I was part of. So if you ever see my Instagram, I'm like, what is that LF? It's Ladies Favorites. A little inside. Ladies Favorites. <laughs> Can you blend? Oh, okay. He's going to be a couple Ladies Favorites. <laughs> After this. Right, right. Well, thank you so much for being here. Thank you guys so much. I appreciate I'm it. I'm Susan Rubin. And I'm Marvin. And I'm Marcus Majors. And you're watching Say What TV. Yeah. <laughs> He's been watching. <laughs> Bye.